Okay, so you could read the context of the word prom, but um, they tell us the test statistic is 2.5 and the critical value is 2.3. So as long as this is a right tail test, yeah, because they say it's over 21 cases, so it is a right tail test. They're claiming that it's over 20, over like uh, whatever their average cases was. Critical value they told us is 2.33. And the test statistic was 2.5. That means our test statistic is in the rejection region. We would reject the null hypothesis under this. So uh, choose the appropriate test. It's a right-tailed test because they said over a certain, um, you know, a previous, some sort of stated amount. Uh, they told us the critical value was 2.33, and the test statistic was 2. What was it? Five. 2.50. Okay, so that's all we need to do for that map, I guess. <clears throat> Make sure the test statistic is the bigger one. Uh, and then is there sufficient evidence? We'd say yes, because the test statistic is beyond the critical value. It's in the rejection region. Uh, so yes, there is sufficient evidence for the, to reject the null hypothesis because the critical value falls. No, it's the test statistic that falls in the rejection region. The critical value decides on that rejection region.